hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel in today video we are actually telling about that how to cure your pothos in your home pothos is a low maintenance winning indoor plant that easily mistaken for philodendron due to its similar heart shaped leaves easy to care for and to propagate pothos plants are an excellent house plant for a beginner gardener the easiest way to propagate pothos plants is to use stem cutting Simply take in your modern plant and cut off a stem that contains at least two leaves. Place the cut stem into a container of water. After a couple of weeks, the cutting should be to root in the water. Once the new roots are about three inches long, transplant your new plant into a container with potting soil. A pothos plant is one of the easiest house plant to grow if you follow a few simple pothos care guidelines. Number one. Plant pothos venus in well-drained potting soil. The only soil requirement for a pothos plant is good drain. So any high-quality, well-drained potting soil or potting mix will do the trick. For any even higher drain capacity, try mixing fertile into your soil before plantation. Number 2. Provide pothos plants with bright indirect light. Pothos plants tolerate low light condition but their leaf variegation may fade if they are in the shade for too long. For trimming photos plant with vibrant variegation leaves, place them in bright indirect light. To avoid scratched or discolored leaves, make sure to keep photos plants away from direct sunlight. Number 3. Let the top inch of soil dry out between watering. When the top pinch of soil is dry, it's time for more water or your plant leaves may be to wilt. Keep watering your photos until water seeps out from the pot's drained holes. To avoid root caused by sugar soil, pour out the water that falls in the dry or dish under the pot. If you notice your plant has yellow leaves, it's likely a sign that you are overwatering. Number 4 Use liquid house plant fertilizer. Pothos plants are thrived without fertilizer, but fertilizing once a month during the spring and summer growing season helps to maximize their growth. Number five, keep temperature moderate. Pothos plants grow between 60 and 80 degree fertilizers with high levels of humidity similar to tropic environments. Don't fret if your air is on the dry side. Even though they are flourishing in high humidity, pothos plants tolerate all humidity level. Number 6. Report pothos plants occasionally. If your pothos plant is dropping, no matter how often you water it, that sign it's become root bound. Select a new container that is a couple of inches wider than the current pot and report the plant once its growing season being in the spring. Hope so this video is very informative for you all guys. At the end of this video I just want to say to subscribe my channel, like or share my video. Don't forget to comment and thanks for watching.